Realtor Carl Miller with Dalton and Company. As a realtor, what is it that you see is the reason that people don't get the inspection? Are they concerned that the cost? What would be the reason? Because there, this is a huge investment. Right. There's two things. I would say this: ninety, probably ninety-eight percent, ninety-nine percent of buyers will get an inspection. Is uh, it required by law? It's not required by law at uh-huh. all. But it's it is like. It's a three hundred dollar. Well, it depends on the size of the house. Two hundred seventy five to four hundred dollar investment. Again, you know what you're getting into because here's the thing: after closing, if there's a problem with the house, it's your baby as a buyer. So <laughs> your there's no going back to the seller saying you didn't tell us about whatever. Mm-hmm. So the reason that uh, the only people that I work with that don't get inspections are usually investors. They're buying these cheap foreclosures or, or homes that are you know they know they're getting there's a project no negotiating already. to yeah. get it fixed. So it's just hey, I'm comfortable with this. Come what may, I'm going to buy this house. But for sellers, I'd probably the reason that people don't do it, there's two reasons. Number one is the cost. Number two, the burden of proving anything is wrong is is typically on the buyer, right? So when a seller does an inspection, now they know about a problem. Now we've come into some liability issues where maybe they need to disclose material adverse facts about and the that house, gets especially very complicated. if the realtor knows about it. The seller in Virginia doesn't need to disclose. That's what's kind of interesting about Virginia. We are a caveat emptor state, which means that buyer beware. The sellers don't have to fill out long disclosure forms about, I know this is working, this is not working, this is not working. That's not a form that's filled out in Virginia, unlike some other states. So what happens is if I, as a real estate agent, know about a problem with a house that's a material adverse fact, uh, I have to disclose that. Mm-hmm. So sometimes it's just, well, ignorance is bliss type of thing. But yeah. the reality is, is that, you know, I've always tried to operate my business with integrity. And if there's a problem there, we're going to disclose it. You know, we have to. Check out our website if you want to get information on any listing in the market. And that's carlmillerteam.com. Carl with a